Yeah. You want another video? Uh, Bayonetta 2 is going to be coming out pretty soon. Uh, I think it's coming out next month. But uh, I've been looking on YouTube and on Facebook and stuff, and I've been seeing the comments made by Sony fanboys and Microsoft fanboys. Uh, Microsoft camp uh, fanboys, you know, they saying the usual thing that the Wii U is dogs, dog shit, whatever. But then I made a comment on that post and I said that, yep, it might be dog, you know, shit to y'all, but that dog shit is going to come out with a bunch of games. And then, and then I started thinking about Bayonetta 2. And every time they show footage of Bayonetta 2 on YouTube, Sony fanboys mostly are, you know, dogging the game and saying it's not going to sell. But I want to make this video to let the Sony fan base know, the Microsoft fan base know, that Bayonetta 2 is for y'all. It's for y'all. See, for, for a long time, uh, especially Sony fans, they've been saying that Nintendo is nothing but Mario, Zelda, and a bunch of kiddie games. They don't make no mature games. I understand that Bayonetta 2, yes, is made by a third party, but Nintendo is finding the game, and they're publishing the game, which, make it a, which really makes the game a first party game. The Nintendo, the Nintendo audience, yes, they're going to buy the game. But the game is geared towards the Sony and Microsoft audience. Because Nintendo, you know, I guess they're getting tired of saying that Nintendo is nothing but Mario and Zelda. So they go out and get a game that was going to get canceled and funded. And that game is Bayonetta 2 plus Bayonetta 1. So, I remember a couple months ago, Sony saying that they was going to go after the Wii, the original Wii audience, which was 100 million strong, and mostly the Wii audience was casual players. Uh, the casual audience, Sony's not going to get. They have moved on to, uh, you know, smartphones or tablets or whatever. But... Nintendo is trying to get the um, the Sony and Microsoft audience. And the, the games they started with is Bayonetta 2 and Devil's Third. So you can't say that Nintendo is nothing but Mario and Zelda. They're proving you wrong. So you got to put your money, you got to, you got to shut up about that now because Nintendo is trying. So the game is for you. Bayonetta 2 is for you. It's for Sony and Microsoft fanboys to get a Wii U. You will not find Wii U exclusive games on Microsoft and you will not find them on PlayStation. This game is going to stay on the Wii U as long as Nintendo wanted to be on the Wii U. As a matter of fact, like I said in my other videos, even Platinum has came out and said that it is up to Nintendo if they want uh, the sequel to Wonderful 101 or Platinum 3 on the Wii U. So it's all up to Nintendo. So Nintendo is reaching out in all this uh, uh, olive branch for y'all. So Nintendo fans mostly owns uh, Wii U, uh, uh, it's, yeah, they own a Wii U, but then they own a PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. And most of the time, the game that is exclusive to them console, they go in, out and buy that console for them games. I want to see if Sony fanboys or Microsoft fanboys going to do the same. Are they y'all going to buy a Wii U for Bayonetta, Devil's Third? Or are y'all gonna sit there on the on the sidelines complaining that Nintendo is nothing but Zelda and Mario in kitty games? So put your money 
where you put your money where your mouth is. If, I, if it was a game that I wanted on the PlayStation or Xbox One, I would go get them games. I would go buy the console. So, you cannot use that excuse no more. Bayonetta 2 is a, is a game. Nintendo got that game for y'all. For Sony and Microsoft fans to enjoy or to get a Wii U. Y'all have a blessed day. Bye.